Oh, Father. How you love your people. How you care for them so much. How you want to dispel the darkness of their minds and bring light. I had a feeling that was uneasy and I couldn't pinpoint exactly what it was. I just knew that I was not happy. I was not the same person that I was. I just wasn't feeling myself. The Friday leaving up to Sunday service, my family had asked what was going on with me. I felt as though I had been disappointed. I put a lot of pressure on myself, and I know that others tend to do the same as well, but I put a lot of pressure. I felt like things had to be perfect. And I felt that pressure, and I don't know exactly where it came from, but I also felt as though I was constantly giving my all to other people. But I felt that when I was at this point, when I was hurt, I wasn't receiving that same type of reciprocation of someone that was there for me. I felt like as though I was by myself. Sunday, we went to church, and the first thing Pastor spoke about, he mentioned that it wasn't the message he originally was going to talk about, but he decided to speak about something else that was on his heart, and he began to explain how the devil comes into your life and he will take from you. When we think of John 10.10, 10, where Jesus says, the thief comes to do what? Yeah. Come on, come on, let's get it. He comes to do what? Because in stealing, he leaves a condition. He leaves you in a state that's different. He comes to take away your peace. He comes to steal your courage because he knows what the absence of courage can do. It can leave you in despair and hopelessness. It's not the thing that the devil it's after, it's the condition created by the absence of the thing. And that's exactly what I was feeling those two weeks prior leading up to that Sunday. That same hurt I spoke about and that I was discussing with my parents, they turned to me when pastor started his message and they looked at me and I said, I know that this message is for me. But in that same sense, I knew that there was no way Pastor gave a message just for me. I knew that there was thousands of other people in the church and that this message couldn't resonate with just me. And that's when I noticed that other people were also impacted by his message and that I wasn't alone. And now I feel I'm like I'm back to myself. I'm happy and I'm joyful. I appreciate and I'm so grateful for everything that I have going on in my life.